Christ, this is spooky. What's that? Grim sticking wires in your head, man. I just need to sync the encryption signature between his subdermals and Fort Meade. Don't like that. I know. It's for after we land. You better hurry up, Grim. We touch down in Georgia in 15. I'm already done. Lambert? Hey, Irving, do you read me? Tell her I read her. He reads you. Good. You ready to get to work? I'd feel better if I knew what was going on. You know what you need to. The CIA lost a mole inside Georgian President Combe Nikoladze's cabinet. Her name is Alice Madison. They sent in Agent William Robert Blaustein to find her and lost him too. Are we working with the CIA's cooperation? Blaustein is outfitted with subdermals just like yours. That'll be your best lead to find him. You didn't answer my question. We'll tell you what you need to know. You're not out there alone, Fisher. Through me, you're attached to a dozen of the best NSA minds we have. There are political complexities with Georgia you'd need a week to understand. I've just about memorized the speech language. Well, start believing it. This is third echelon's maiden voyage, and we need it to go smooth as butter. You're about to touch down in Georgia. Get ready. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back. This is Pi, and we're going to be playing the first actual mission on uh, Splint Cell. We did the tutori tutorial last time, and now we're going to be doing the first mission. I think this game was like the best game ever made in 2002. The graphics for its time is amazing. I don't know why. Like, look at those lights pretty cool they've got um, glows on them and whatnot I like it although it's just like a plain alpha seems so <laughs> I don't know what's going on so we're gonna move our make our way up here oh by the way this game doesn't is really terrible at saving um, I already got caught it seems which is weird I get caught a lot I'm gonna move down here. Let's go through this. I actually need to turn the volume down a bit, it's a bit too loud. There we go, that's good. I'm gonna be making our way. I don't I'm not sure what the mission is. What is a mission? The goals are to rendezvous with the local NSA informant Thomas Goodabud for information on Blaustein's area of operation. And we have to do that without killing civilians or we'll fail the mission and we can't touch the street otherwise that will also result in a mission failure that's nice to know thank you for that so I guess we go up here first and then we zip line my favorite part is zip lining seems those people are going I think we go this way. Uh, okay. Do we jump? I find it weird how they used um, shift for jump. That's a bit odd. Yeah, used to it after a while though. I think the other games actually change it around a bit, so it's not shift anymore. But I'm not sure. I'll have to wait on that. I guess we go this way. And up. Oh. There he is. Hello. And you want to be an NSA agent for that reason alone. Okay, we're gonna. I'm actually gonna check if there's a way to quick save. There is a way to quick save. F5. Oh, there is quick save. That's nice to know. Sounds. Uh, why is the sound so low? Uh, the voice sounds are very low. It's really weird. Why the sounds are so low? But it's nice to know there's quick save. 
I guess we go for this smoke. There's too much smoke. Shoot out the twilight. Without dying. I didn't see the point of that. Still breathing? Doing my best. Good. Blaustein's black box is your next objective. I'm running standard ACC trade craft. You'll find the box behind a fake bookshelf or wall pattern. Should we go this way? It seems so. Now see, I had to make that jump, but uh, also alerted the guards, which is a bit annoying. Ooh. Just knock this guy out. Bang! Let's hide his body. In case someone else comes out, I'm not sure because I haven't played this game in a while. But, just in case, let's see who's here looking. Well, there is. We can slide open this. Oh, where'd this guy pop out from? That was lame. That was very lame. Could we actually have done something else? Like climb the roof? No, we couldn't. That was a bit annoying. Okay, so we gotta search for something in his house, I guess. It's uh did he what are we supposed to do? Uh find a bl black box hidden in Blaustein's apartment, okay. Um let's go this way. They're always in the bedroom. It's always in the bedroom. Can't be anyone else. He's got a lot of paintings. Uh, there is a key code. Is any? Just run around until you find something. There, there we go. There might be the painting. I guess that's it. Okay. Um, the code for his balcony door is zero nine one seven seven two. Okay, so it's um zero nine one seven seven two. There we go. And um, we need to go to the precinct. I think I'm not sure. I'm guessing that's where we go. Oh, we gotta go a bit this way because don't wanna fall down. There we go. Who is that? I wish that didn't happen. Uh, which way do we go? Do we go that way? I'm assuming we go that way. Hey, we should have a map, shouldn't we? Um. Uh, where is the map? Okay, so we need to find. I don't even know where I am. Uh, okay, let's just have a look here. I don't know what I'm doing exactly, but let's go this way. I think I'm gonna go this way. Might be killing that guy. Is he looking at me? He is. I don't know if he's a. He looks like a bad guy. So I might be going that way, maybe. No problem. If he's gonna come here and stop. As long as you didn't hear me when I fall. Oh, come on. That was fail. That was pretty tight. Still breathing? Doing my best. Good. Hello? Black is your next objective. 
That wasn't good. Okay, we gotta do this again. That was bad. I don't know what happened there, but whatever. There's too much smoke. So shoot out the that was pretty tight. Still breathing? Doing my best. Good. Blow these black Who boxes are next objective. Terrible. Running standard HQ trade craft. You'll find the box behind a fake bookshelf or wall pad. Who is that? Oh great, you heard me. I gotta do this again. It's a bit of an annoyance. Oh, someone died. Hopefully that puts me in pitch darkness, but then again, I'm not really sure if it does. When you open the door, I'll just say peekaboo. If he does open the door, that is. I guess not. He is, however, standing there. Die! Jesus Christ. Oh, what was that? Like? Well, that was just a piece of thing. So anyway, we need to get moving. Because we did. I keep on forgetting to F quick save. So I need to press F5. So that was my bad. So we need to find the note. It's 091772. 1772. Let's save that here. Ah, there we go. We didn't make any noise this time. That's cool. So, we actually have to stay off the street. So, I'm guessing we'd go this way. Because I don't see any other way. And then, can we just jump on that? Yeah, we can. Slide down this way. Open this. Looks like the game is slowly coming back to me. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna use a pick locks. This is kind of pointless. I mean, all you're doing is hitting random buttons. You see the WSAD, and you just gotta hit random buttons. It's kind of pointless. So now we gotta take care of these guys. If we just take care of this light, I think we might not have to. Oh dear. Holy crap, that was close. I think that's what we do. How about drunken disorderly, assaulting a police officer, slandering the badge? You said you associated with criminals. Ah, then arrest me. I'm a criminal. Weren't you listening? The rent's gone up in jail. You want to die tonight? That's free. You want to sleep tonight? It'll cost you 100 lari. Oh, please. I don't. I don't. Oh. And he's gone. Uh, now what are we going to do with him? Check his pockets. I'll radio HQ. We need to quickly get down here now. We have a 1053. Possible assault. Can you send an ambulance? Copy that, Unit 3. But we're dealing with a warehouse fire, so expect delay. Roger that, dispatch. We'll wait with the victim. Unit 3 out. Oh? Phew. We can pin on Costa. <laughs> Good thinking. Hope we can turn this light off. Who is that? Man, this is what I don't like. This part here. That's not good. Do I wait now? 
I'm just gonna save this here. Maybe we can knock this guy out. Oh dear, no, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Ah! Wait, now, why would he go there for? Knock this guy out. Um, you can move on. I probably should have hit that body, but... Meh. Can we actually climb on this? Hello? Who's there? Uh, no one you wanna know. Oh dear. Can you see anything? I hope not. Pretty sure there's a way to do this properly, but I'm not. I'm not following the way because I can't remember how you do this. Just as long as he didn't spot me, which I think he might end up doing eventually. Or not. Let's just keep on moving on. I'm going to have to keep on hitting quick save every time now. Because I'm not sure when I'll fail. Okay. Is anything going on here? There's a guy there. Which is not good. How do these guys get so suspicious? I mean, it's just... What's the point in silent suppressor when everyone else can hear it? Kind of beats the purpose of it. So, remember, we need to go this way, and then, um, I think it's sort of a triggered sequence, where if you grab, um, I'm actually going to use that medkit, and do some weird orgasmic sounds, which is really creepy. So now we're going to go to the police precinct, precinct, and... We gotta find information. Okay, look. So the gates open out the blue for some reason. I don't know how that happens, but whatever. I think we can just make it past. Without any problems. And now I believe we can go this way. I'm not too sure on that though. I don't know what's wrong with the aiming. <laughs> it's a bit off. What's that light doing on top of the church? It's just moving. Oh, is he a normal guy? I hope so. He better be. Uh, what can I do with this? There's an object here. Oh, is it just stuff I can pick up? Yep, it was a distraction, so I can... Oh dear. Ow. That didn't help. I think you have to knock him up from behind. I'm wasting like two bullets each time I need to do that. Which is a bit weird. I don't know what that guy is doing. He's just running around. Like a complete loony. Let's take out this last light. I don't know. Just go with it. Deal with it. Oh dear. There we go. Seems like you're KO'd. And let's climb up here. It's always nice to stay above people. Stay away. Think that is a police person. I'm not sure though. And this is the only way I know of getting across. It's a bit weird. But there you go. 
I, I think you have to look in the direction when you're doing the double jump thing. It's a bit weird. So this is a police precinct that we need to go to. And what's uh, the door code for the precinct basement is 5929, which is what we're going to enter here. Uh, 5929. There we go. Not the most hardest code ever to exist. I remember this part. I remember it because I kept on failing. It's not good. No, it isn't. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. You don't know me. You can't see me. I'm invisible. Stay away. How long is he going to keep on looking at the light? You can stop looking at the light now. <laughs> what is he doing? He keeps on looking at the light. This is not right. This is wrong. Well, I might just have to kill him now, but he's a police officer. One doesn't simple. Well, I'm an NSA, so whoosh. That's a shame. He could have just listened. But no, someone wanted to be a smarty pants. Okay, there's a guy in there. Do I go there? I'm not sure if I do. There's like one guy in there. Let's just save this here in case. Just in case. Okay. Um, let's hope he didn't come this way. I'm going to wait anyway. The thing about the game is mostly a trial and error game. So you have to kind of figure out what's happening. Then fail a couple of times until, until you finally realize. That is what you were supposed to do. So let's just take care of this guy. Let's see if we can get any useful information out of him. One false move and you're dead. I need information. Uh, okay. I'm looking for two Americans. Probably dead. I... Can I go with kill me? Ah, where are they? Nearby. The morgue. They're dead. I helped the mortician find the microchip out of the scalp. The subdermals. Yeah. Please don't hurt me. That's all I know. Ah. Bye. I like doing that. <laughs> Let's just search the computers anyway. We have a data stick. I don't know, there's tons of data sticks. I don't know what the hell any of them are supposed to do. I don't know. Um, is anything going else going on wrong here? I think there's a camera there, which you can see. So I might need to take that out. There we go. I've got Agent Blaustein in Madison. Rest in peace. Somebody cut out those subdermals. Where do we go from here? We follow the subdermals if we can. Mm -hmm. There's a security camera here. Good thinking. We can track the subdermals from the video archive. Station surveillance room is on the top floor. Ah, oh, great. That's nice to know. Station surveillance. We gotta go into the police station. This is the one lousy police station, if you ask me. Quick saving to death, like every second or so, because I don't want to do this again. So I'm making like 10 different quick saves. Are you serious? Can I help you? I'd like to register a complaint. Then you'll have to ask at the desk to your right. Very well. Very well. Okay, is this guy gonna be doing anything? Seems to be just standing there. You sure the same cop? Yes, but this is the public relations desk. <laughs> I would like to register a complaint. Of course, sir. But you could just have a seat until somebody's ready to help you. You've got to be kidding me. I could easily have you arrested, sir. <laughs> well, that was kind of funny. Sort of. You shouldn't be doing that to a guy. It's bad. Corrupt. 
police officials everywhere. I need to take care of this guy. You can... Well, that didn't go as well as I planned. That's a shame you had to die, you know. Let's just turn off the lights. And let's go this way. Can't see Jack because it's so dark. And there are two people here. Can we just knock these guys out? And it's like, dunk. Let's lock, knock out you, the other guy as well. I'll knock him out in his chair. There we go. He's sorted. And they're all locked. Um, I think the key thing, the pay locking is a bit pointless. I don't it's well, why bother? It's very useful. Oh my god, I'm not gonna do it for that one. I'm just gonna go for opening the door. See what's in, what's in this door anyway. I unlocked it. I might as well find out. Of course, there's an interrogation going on. Hello. I think he's dead or just unconscious. Either way, I don't care. Let's go to this room. Well, this looks like something important. Anyone here? There is a guy here. Nice to know. Break! Any more? Um, Satchel? For what? Oh, right, okay. Great work, Fisher. We're scanning the video tape now. There, that's our guy. We got him red handed. Then you run his face through Echelon. Already on it. Hey, check it out. A license plate. H4KP214. Fantastic. Fisher, we got what we need. Rendezvous with Wilkes to work here is done. We'll get back to you once we've sifted this intel. Okay, where do I go now? Oh, in front of the police precinct. So I'm guessing I go down. Oh, let's head down. I think this is the front. I'm not sure if it is. Hey! Mission completed. And we did that all in one episode. That was cool. That was really cool. I enjoyed it. I like that. The bodies of Agents Blouse and Madison were located in the morgue of the Tbil Tbilisi Police Precinct. Who the hell gives these names? Before being sent to Georgia, the agents have been outfitted with subdermal tracking implants. These implants were removed from their corpses and taken to the Georgian Ministry of Defense by a man named Balat. Cheslav Grinko. Well, that's the end of this one, and we'll carry on the next mission in the next part. So until then, guys, goodbye.